we will discuss about Stephen Hawking, one of the pioneer in the history of science, by whom each and every citizen of the world has been inspired and will be in his position. Stephen Hawking's contribution in science became remarkable and its contribution in the history of science is really speechless. But unfortunately, March 14, 2018 became one of the sad news for all the citizens throughout the world. Now let's me introduce about Stephen Hawking. Stephen Hawking was born in 1942 in Oxford, England. He was the eldest of the four children that his parents had. Stephen Hawking's parents preferred to reside in Oxford, England, despite that they have their personal home in North London and the World War II was on. Stephen Hawking's parents relocated to St. Albans when Stephen Hawking was eight years of age. Stephen Hawking loves to disorganize radios and some other instruments. Therefore, Stephen Hawking's parents registered him in the private school in St. Albans at the age of 11 in preparation college in Oxford. As a teenager, he had been so ambitious to be a mathematician despite that his father prefers him to go for medicine. His parents were alumnus of Oxford University. Stephen Hawking's result was excellent and he proceeded to Oxford University to study physics because mathematics course wasn't available. He graduated with first class and proceeded to Cambridge University where he specializes on cosmetology and majored in physics. As a child, Stephen Hawking was never physically doing something that is difficult, but when he was a third year in college, everything was difficult. When he was at Oxford, he felt weak and sometimes collapsed for no reason. His father took him to their family physician. In 1962, he was diagnosed of having low Gehrig's disease which leads to brain, nerve cells and spinal cord deterioration. The doctor could not give normal medication but just gave him ordinary vitamins because he thought that this will sustain Stephen Hawking for little years about the diagnosis as the day for such disease do occur through suffocations or pneumonia. Therefore, the doctor told his parents that there was no remedy for such sickness. This conclusion of day kept him in dilemma as he did not know whether to proceed on his work to pursue his PhD. Stephen Hawking was popular in his college too. He came across a woman in 1963 called Jane Willie who was schooling at Westfield College in London. Stephen Hawking proceeded in his PhD in faith and completed it. Stephen Hawking became a research fellow in Dunville and Cash College in Cambridge and got married to Jane Wilde in 1965. They have three children named Robert, Lucy and Timothy. Stephen Hawking proceed in his cosmology studies and ignores all his medical condition. This disease led him to be wheelchair bound and his life depends on his family and the attendant and still he did not stop functioning at the high levels as he carried on his research without doing any lecturing because he could not speak as such. Stephen Hawking became a profession. He joined applied mathematics and theoretical physics in 1973 and became Lossitian Professor of Mathematics in 1979. Things began to be difficult for Stephen Hawking 
and in 1980 his family employed nurses for him. In 1985 he was infected with pneumonia and trachymetony. He could not speak or communicate. It got a stage where he used computer program to communicate to a handheld switch. Through this method, he was able to write books, papers, and lectures. Stephen Hawking and Roger Van Rose invented Einstein theory of relativity, showing that space and time came to existing through the Big Bang and indeed in black holes. Stephen Hawking also involved in making the hypothesis in 1981 and 1983 that the universe has no boundaries, both in physical and temporal. Stephen Hakim has 12 honorary degrees with awards and now receiving full-time care which was paid for through many foundation grants. So, my friends, in this video, you may have understood some inventions done by Stephen Hakim's. Though Stephen Hakim's passed away on March 14, 2008, but his dedication, his inventions remained unmemorable in the history of science. Furthermore, Professor Stephen Hawking has 13 honorary degrees. His degrees will remain in the core of art of every scientist, of every researcher, and of every expert. He was awarded CBE, Company of Honor, in 1982 and in 1989. His award gave a lot of lessons to the scientists who are practicing to be Stephen Hawking. He also received the Presidential Medal of Freedom in 2009. He is the recipient of many awards, medals and prizes, most notably the Fundamental Physics Prize in 2013, Copley Medal in 2006 and the World Foundation Prize in 1988. Not only this, he is a fellow of the Royal Society and a member of the U.S. National Academy of Science and the Protein Spiel Academy of Sciences. So every listeners, those who are listening to this video, I hope you may have got a lot of information related to Stephen Hawking. Thank you.